How to Replace a Human Touch Whole Body 7.1 or 8.0 Main PCB You will need a Phillips head screwdriver, preferably magnetized, a wire cutter, and zip ties. Be sure to save all removed parts for reassembly. To get started, power off the chair. Then unplug it. Lift up on the backrest release lever, then tip the backrest forward to rest it on the chair seat. Next, loosen, or remove, the two screws from the top of the power panel. Pull the power panel out of the backrest, then unzip the backrest upholstery. Now, feed the power panel, remote control and power cord through the hole in the backrest upholstery. Flip the backrest upholstery over the backrest. Lift up on the black plastic mechanism cover to detach it, then remove the cover from the chair. Remove the three screws that secure the PCB box to the chair frame. Then, lift the PCB box out of the backrest and set it on top of the backrest with the screws facing up. Now, remove the seven screws that secure the PCB box cover, then remove the cover. Disconnect each of the connectors from the main PCB, cutting the one zip tie that connects the cable bundle to the main PCB cable. You may have to pull very firmly on some of the connectors to disconnect them. Now, remove the 10 screws that secure the PCB to the tray, then remove the PCB. To install the new PCB, place it into position in the tray with the large yellow component in the upper right-hand corner. Align the screw holes, then replace the 10 screws to secure it. Next, reconnect each of the connectors to the PCB, matching by size and color.
Note the small blue connector along the bottom edge connects to a purple cable connector. Install a new zip tie to secure the upper cable bundle in the same location as one was previously installed. Cut the excess zip tie. Place the PCB box cover into position, aligning the screw holes. Make sure there are no cables pinched between the tray and the cover. Replace the seven screws to secure the PCB box cover to the tray. Next, place the PCB box into position between the massage mechanism and the chair frame, pushing the cables on the lower edge of the box underneath the metal bracket so they are not bent. Replace the three screws to secure the PCB box to the chair. Note the tabs along the edge of the black plastic mechanism cover and the corresponding slots on the chair. Insert the right-hand tabs into the slots, lower the cover into position, then insert the left-hand tabs into the slots. Now tuck the upper and lower tabs into their respective slots. Flip the backrest upholstery back into position. Then, feed the remote, the power cord, and the power panel through the hole in the upholstery. Next, close the backrest zippers. Slide the tab on the lower edge of the power panel under the chair frame. Then, pushing the power panel cables into the backrest, lower the upper edge of the panel into position. Replace the two screws to secure the power panel to the chair. Finally, plug in the chair, power it on, then confirm that the chair is working properly.